I've been affected by the mental disorder known as obsessive compulsive disorder, also known as OCD. OCD is an anxiety disorder characterized by unreasonable thoughts and fears or obsessions that lead you to do repetitive behaviors. Treatments include help with a psychologist or medication. Many people have unreasonable fears and claim to have OCD, but to be medically diagnosed like myself, it must interfere with the quality of life and take up an hour of your day. Last school year pretty much completely took over my life and also caused me physical damage, not just mental. It also can lead to or accompany depression. You generally feel down doing the repetitive behaviors and having no control over them. Uh, it takes up a lot of your time because you have to over redo things over and over again. Yes, because I will have to wait for you or so on. That's a weird answer, but yeah. Yeah, you've started to uh, not repeat your activities as much. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. Because I have to wait for you. Yeah. This video is an example of me parking my car, locking it, and then walking back to double check to make sure it was locked. This was an everyday occurrence last, last year. This also occurred in the middle of the night. I found myself losing sleep, worrying, and having to go check in the middle of the night. Also, I left the movie halfway through just to double check it was locked before. Another action that plagued me was constantly washing my hands to a point where it was 20 to 30 times a day and my hands would constantly bleed from extreme dryness. I also have a huge issue with touching doorknobs that aren't in my own house. I washed them before I ate anything, no matter what and no matter the last time I washed my hands. I would wash my hands before using the bathroom, along with after and after I touched the handle of the bathroom. This is an example of a symptom of mine where as soon as someone in the classroom coughed or sneezed, I would get the feeling that the germs were in my mouth and I would have to stand up and spit them out in the trash. This would happen multiple times a class period. It was my most reoccurring and annoying symptom. Thanks to months of therapy and medication, my habits have no longer affected my day-to-day -day life in a severe fashion.